uh, here's one of the old growth pines up here at these rocks on North Fork Mountain. Wow, all the number of branches. I think it's pretty darn old. It's about a foot diameter uh, base there, the trunk. Big tree. That's my tripod, it's six feet high there. So the tree's about six feet wide. Wow. And the canopy. This is very much original growth forest here. This little secluded spot. There's no signs anyone's coming here lately. You got another big tree right there in the middle of your screen. Or right there, that one. Got them all through here. Down wood, a couple over there, rotting. This is amazing forest. There's one over there, you can see the lateral branches. Here's some more old growth pines up here. These ones are protected from the elements a little better and uh, there's a little more soil here, a little, little away from the cliffs. Really something, these are old trees. See how many branches they have? It's a good indicator. A lot of branches in there. There's genuine old growth here. Pines and oaks. More over this way. Here's one of the old growth pines up here. This is hundreds of, at least a couple, I don't know, I mean, I have a way to date it, but look at the shape and how many branches it has. Shaped by the wind on the cliffs. Dead hollow. This shows how the trees are hollow here. It's a dead tree. But that's good. It helps it helps the soil and insects and woodpeckers and all kinds of stuff. Another dead one over there. There's a big one over there. That one's looks like four feet across. This one's maybe five feet across. Branches go out lateral. It's a good sign that it's an older tree. Old growth forest here. It's pretty amazing, I think. Yeah, see that dead tree over there? It's pretty big. Lots of downed trees and bigger trees. Now the trees don't get huge on this mountain because the uh, soils are poor. Sandstone soils. So it burned maybe, maybe. But it was never logged. There's one way back there. <laughs> <laughs> 